Hello, and thank you for being a CorelTrainer.com member. This is your instructions on how to download and install your CorelDRAW 2021.5 from us. You'll get an email from us, and the version that we give you is a full CorelDRAW license, graphic suite, one-time, will-work-forever version for Windows 10 or Windows 11. It is a download-only version. You'll need this specific link and the serial number that we'll provide to you in that email. There are no discs or clip art that come with your Corel Draw graphics suite from us. Actually, we don't know of any that still exist, but it does include Corel Capture, Corel Photo Paint, and other Corel resources included in Corel's graphics suite package. Corel Draw 2021.5 that I'm running now also is identical to the Corel version that you'll download straight from Corel.com, but the licenses that we provide do require this specific download instead of theirs because theirs has a lot of tech in order to try to get you to purchase more Corel resources as well as theirs is ultimately just a trial to begin with while this is a full installation version. It is incredibly important for you to have a Corel.com account. You must let us know what your Corel.com account is and you can make sure that you have a Corel.com account by clicking in the upper right of Corel.com. Attempt to log in with your email address if it does not recognize you, create an account here and then let us know what your Corel.com account is. Ultimately, we're just reaching out to our rep over at Corel Corporation and asking them to associate your email address with your Corel.com account to the new serial number that we just emailed you. Once they've done so, usually overnight, but sometimes up to 72 hours, you'll simply finish the installation process and see your new serial number, your new license, in your account. If you have a trial version of CorelDRAW 2021 or 2022 on your computer right now, first uninstall it before you proceed. Those trial versions do double checks that are unnecessary with this RAW installation that requires just the serial number activation. If you have a previous version of CorelDRAW, let's say CorelDRAW 2018 or X7 or something like that on your computer, go ahead and leave it. No need to uninstall that. Either by clicking the link provided or by simply highlighting it, copy and paste into your web browser will initiate the download. Hit enter. Often at the bottom of your screen the download will start and you'll pull that up and say or allow rather the download to initiate. I already have it on my computer so I will simply cancel. Quite often on many computers just from that bottom tab and depending on your web browser sometimes it's up at the top you can also open or run that folder that was just downloaded with your Corel Draw in it. You may need to access your downloads folder on your computer, which is in your folders or finder, or in my case, my downloads simply appear on my desktop. Really, you'll just need to access that download. When opening the download, you'll likely run into additional security warnings. Your computer ultimately will make sure that you want to make changes to your computer a couple times, especially when it's a downloaded source. Click open. And the folder that comes up after that is a zipped folder, a compressed folder. We found that on Windows 11, it is best to take all this contents and bring it over to your desktop and let go, or to another folder and let go, so that it's not trying to run the installer from the zip folder. On Windows 10, though, we do not run into any issues. It seems we can just open the x64 folder, scroll down to the setup application, and I'll stretch this out so you guys can see all the options in the x64 folder. The one we want only says setup and is an application. Double click there. Your computer will ask you again if you're sure you'd like to install CorelDRAW. Say yes and let the installer run. You'll notice on my computer I currently have CorelDRAW open so it would like me to close those before we continue. This may take a few minutes to install depending on your computer you'll want to do the standard or recommended version of the install as well. Corel's already installed on mine, so it's just asking me to modify, but yours will walk through the installation. I will cancel, and then bring back up CorelDRAW as if you were. The CorelDRAW that first opens is going to bring you to the welcome screen. This is an internet link to Corel's website that will always try to sell you something new. The version of CorelDRAW you got from us is not the subscription and does not require monthly or yearly purchases. It is the one-time license of which you will activate automatically when the screen comes up or under Help, Activations, or Account Settings. 
that screen that would have come up is accessed that way, but most times it comes up automatically. And again, you'll simply log into your Corel.com account here and then copy paste that serial number from the email that we sent you. My workspace looks slightly different than yours, so I'd like to show you the default workspace, how your Corel Draw will initially look to you. Get started by hitting the plus in the upper left or the new page. Confirm the size of that new page and you can start learning Corel. As we recommend, decreasing the size of your window in Corel Draw and watching videos on a second screen or a split monitor. Thanks again for becoming a member of CorelTrainer.com. If you have any questions, including how to customize your workspace, simply reach out to us at support at CorelTrainer.com. See you in the classes!